You see just a little thin layer of haze over our morning sky and by this time tomorrow guys I expect we'll probably see a bit more of that haze build up kind of filtering more of the sunshine as wildfire smoke is expected to work its way down across the valley floor in the next 24 hours. But right now let's savor what we have gorgeous view here of Fairfield as we take into Solano County. Sun is up. You're not seeing much of any of that fog layer outside. It's a hazy sunrise for the most part and in Fairfield. Here's where we're going in the next few hours. We'll be in the upper 60s by 9 a.m. moving up to the upper 70s by mid morning. We'll have sunshine and that southwest wind steady about 10 to 15 for the afternoon. That'll lead us to daytime highs in the lower mid 90s all across Solano County. I do anticipate in our weather headlines. What's new about today is while we start the day with those southwest winds, more of the central valley and we'll notice a steer to the north wind as we head through the next few hours. What's next is that that wildfire smoke will get dragged down from the north with that north wind influence and make its way across the valley floor. Let me give you a closer look at the timing on this. Here's future cast wind when those winds will start to steer more northerly. This is four o'clock in the afternoon. Now it's not a terribly strong wind, but it's enough to get the circulation going from the north and right down the valley floor to eventually bring some of that particulate matter from the wildfire smokes to the northwest down into the valley. Northwest winds will be in that range of about 10 to 15 for the central valley as we head through the overnight tonight. And then notice here those winds by daybreak tomorrow still in that north range and you can see a couple of blops there a couple of uh, the yellow contouring I should say on the western side of the Sacramento Valley that's going to indicate that some areas like the Cape Bay Valley will notice those winds a little stronger a little gustier than really let's say areas like Sacramento down and through Stockton or Modesto air quality as it stands right now. It's at moderate concentration to good. So if you're heading out for a morning walk, taking the dog for a stroll or getting the kids out to school, you'll be in fine shape. Now when the air quality will start to change is as we head through the overnight tonight specifically. Here's five o'clock in the afternoon, just a thin layer of haze, especially going around Butte County. Then watch that wildfire smoke. A thicker plume starts to navigate from north to south down the valley floor. Biggest impact will be the air quality potentially going from moderate to maybe unhealthy for sensitive groups, especially as we head through the start of tomorrow and that smoke could linger even in through the middle of the day before we start to see a shift in the wind and that's going to come our way with this system on Thursday. More of that onshore breeze will flow and for the mountains, a forecast you want to pay attention to, especially for Friday into Saturday could see some showers pop up, but for the valley, we're going to be dry. It's just that wildfire smoke and the heat we deal with for the next three days. Onshore breeze turns on Thursday and that drops us back to the 80s for the start of the holiday weekend.